Peter Perfect had always kept to himself on the show, but he was the fan favorite. He kept his secret deep within and remained in the closet during the entire Wacky Races series. In 1982, Peter shocked the world and announced he was gay. The gays felt it was too little too late, and society took turns laughing at him in the tabloid. The gays and the straights rejected him. After the cancellation of Wacky Running with the Bulls, depression sat in. Fellow racer Clyde Ant speaks about Peter Perfect. Aw, oh, jeez, everyone knew he was a fag. He's called it like a penis. Close personal friend, Shipper. It's a shame that Paul got shafted in the end. I miss Paul. You mean Peter, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing right now. I am one of the richest men that ever did live. I invested all my wacky race money in the Coca-Cola and Microsoft stocks. So you can go tell that stupid whining ass bear that he can kiss my Arkansas Ozark Mountain moonshine drinking ass. Now the thing about Peter Perfect, well, I feel bad for him and everything, but that's the kind of things that happen to you when you're a god queer. Damn queer. It's sad to see bad things happen to good people. I miss the way he ate with his cheeks and made a Mexican burrow and that when he hired me and it was so and it's just, it's so I really love that guy. Peter Perfect left the race world behind when he committed suicide in his San Francisco apartment in 1985.